Hello, welcome to Texture Myth. In this session, I will tell you a process through which we can delete the data area using CL program. Okay, so before that, firstly, we will create one data area and we'll store some data in it. So I'm using command CRT DTA ARA, then taking F4, and I'm, here I'm passing the data area name as Shermit DA, which will reside in library Shermit 1. Type would be star care, and here I will pass the land length as 100 and initial value I'm passing it as texture myth. okay so this is the pro as we are declaring um, character so there is no need to pass the decimal position we can directly pass length as 100 here fine so it is created to check this we will use work obj command and take f4 passing the data area name as shermit da library is shermit1 then hitting enter so you can see that object is there same thing you can also verify with DSP DTA ARA command. So here you can pass data idea name which is Shermit DA library Shermit 1. So you can see that data is available. Okay. Same data area we will delete but this time we will go through CL program. So let's see. This is very small program. I'm taking a edit mode. So here you can see that a single command is used to delete this data area. So for that you just need to write DLT DTA ARA then press F4 and here you can pass data area name as Shermit DA library as Shermit1. So what it will do this command will delete the data area Shermit DA which resides in library Shermit1. After that we are just printing one message data area deleted. This is just for the confirmation purpose. Okay. So let's compile this program. It is compiled successfully. Now I am calling this. So once I call this program it will show the data area is deleted. Now we can verify the same with work obj command. So taking work obj press F4. Library D, uh, data area name is shermit da. Library is shermit1. Hitting enter. So you can see cannot find object to match a specified name. Same thing we will again verify with the help of DSP DTA ARA command. Taking F4 passing the library data area name as shermit da. Library is shermit1. So you can see it is showing data area shermit da and shermit1 not found because this program has deleted that object. Okay. So whenever there is any requirement where you want to delete a data area completely, uh, you want to delete a data area uh, from your system, then in that case, uh, you can use DLT DTA array command in CL program to delete the data area. I hope this session is clear to all of you. In the next session, we will discuss few more things. So thank you for watching TechShermit.